Tonight we look at AMT Ertl's 1934 Ford Early Modified Stock Car on Monster Hobbies. What's in the box? What's in the box? What's in the box? What's in this box? What's in the box? Hello everybody, my name is Trevor Ursulescu and I'm the owner of Monster Hobbies in High River, Alberta, Canada. Well, who doesn't like to watch the Early Modifieds rip it up on the old dirt track? Tonight we're going to look at the 1934 Ford Early Modified Race Car. So let's go down and take a look at what's in the box. It's race car night at the old dirt circle as we take a look at our 1934 Ford Early Modified Stock Car. Now let's crack open the box and take a look at this bad boy. The first thing we have is the big instruction sheet. And it says 34 Ford Slammer, which is bizarre. But anyway, <laughs> this kit looks like, from the instruction sheet, that it came out in the 1970s originally. Although some of you model kit enthusiasts can confirm that. Or deny it. <laughs> anyway, the instructions are pretty good. Looks like the parts are pretty basic on it. You do get some pretty interesting differential. One that I've never really seen before. It's kind of got a, a diamond shape to it. And there's all the pans and everything to put in. And you get this nice roll bar. And your seats with fire extinguisher. And more on the roll bar. And then you get to drop the body on top and put on this neat little hood. Now, let's take a look at this decal sheet. Which gives you a lot of options for numbers as well as scallops. And your choice of a 427 cubic inch or 428 Cobra jet, which is really neat. And then we will look at the little body. Now this is quite a modified two, two, uh, three window Ford Coupe. I don't think you could use this for stock, like if you were con to convert up a stock version of the 34 Ford, but we don't want to do that because we're race car enthusiasts, right? Yeah, I thought so. Now we have some bags that I actually need to open. So let's get out the old Boy Scout knife from 1986. And cut open the tape on this. Let's see what we got. What's in the bag? What's in this bag? Okay, there's the first part. This is our dashboard. <laughs> if I can hold it. There. See the little instrument panel and the little rod for the steering wheel. And there is the hood as well as some of the frame and bumper bits. And then we have our big huge engine here and our bucket seats for racing, the exhaust pipes. Oh, interesting. There is a floor pan and some roll bars, fire extinguisher and the pedals. Okay, here's that differential. See, it's a really hardcore and beefed up differential, and I've never seen that in any of the model kits, but it sure is cool. Now here's what I was saying interesting about. There's that hood again, and a different type of firewall. So I wonder if this is just a spare parts, or... I, I haven't done this twice, so... Oh, and there's even more coming up in this bag. See, another firewall and a different hood again with a scoop on it, very much like the Cobras. And then this nice air cleaner here, 
big beehive sort of air cleaner. And here are some of the firewalls and whatnot. I suppose it depends on which kit you've got. So there's a lot of spare parts in this for other modifieds or even just to have it in a garage. A garage diorama. There's the frame for this thing. Pretty huge, considering that the car would be like this. It's a lot of frame up front. So yeah, pretty cool. And then here's the wheels for the kit. In fact, there is no chrome in this model. But I guess you don't need it if you're on the dirt track. And finally, what do we have here but another hood? So yeah, you could build quite a neat garage with all these different hoods and things. There's our tires. Really, really huge, huge uh, Goodyears. And the last little bit in this kit is the steering wheel in its own separate bag. Which is really cute. And that brings us to the end of our video of the look at the AMT Ertl 1934 Ford Early Modified. We hope you enjoyed this episode of Monster Hobby's What's in the Box, where we got to look at the 1934 Ford Early Modified Stock Car. And if you would like to see some of the other cool cars in our series, please check here, check here, and check down here. And don't forget to subscribe to us right here so we can continue this amazing series of Monster Hobby's What's in the Box.